we first are gonna divide by a one digit number, then we're gonna divide by a two digit number. So we're gonna start with the division. Let's remember the steps of the division, which is first we're gonna divide, then we multiply, then we subtract, then the last one we bring down. So let's see how we solve the questions, starting from question number A. 946 dividing by 2. I'm gonna make the long division sign. The first number which comes first, gonna go inside, which is 946. Divided by 2, so 2 will be out. We divide by 2. So the first step is to divide, so I'm gonna divide the first digit which is 9 by 2 so 9 dividing by 2 I'm gonna make the timetable of 2 to help me so this is up and this is down 2 by 1 is 2 2 by 2 is 4 2 by 3 is 6 2 by 4 is 8 this is a timetable of 2 so I'm gonna search for 9 in down so I didn't see the number 9 but the the number 8 is almost B9, so I'm gonna take the number 8. So I'm gonna write down 8, because 8 is down, and we first search in down. Then I'm gonna put up 4. Then after division and multiplying 4 by 2 equal 8, we're gonna make subtraction. So 9 minus 8 is 1. Then after subtraction, we're gonna bring down the next number which is 4 then we have 14 I'm gonna search for 14 in the table we didn't reach 14 yet so I'm gonna put 2 by 5 is 10 and 2 by 6 is 12 then 2 by 7 is 14 so here is 14 in down so I'm gonna take 14 down and putting 7 up then we're gonna subtract 14 minus 14 4 minus 4 is 0 1 minus 1 is 0 after subtraction we bring down another number which is 6 the number 6 we search it in down here is 6 so I'm gonna put 6 down and with 6 we have 3 up now I subtract 6 minus 6 is 0 there is no other numbers to bring it down so the answer is 473 let's make another example here is the long division sign the first number is 486 divided by 3 we're gonna write table 3 here here is up and down 3 by 1 equals 3, 3 by 2 equals 6, 3 by 3 equals 9, 3 by 4 is 12, 3 by 5 is 15, 3 by 6 is 18, 3 by 7 is 21. If I need more numbers, I'm gonna continue the timetable. I'm gonna take the first number which is 4, 4, I'm gonna search it down, there is no number called 4, but the nearest number to 4 is 3, so I'm gonna take 3 down and it have 1 up then after I put the number down and the number up I'm gonna subtract 4 minus 3 is 1 after subtraction we bring down the next number which is 8 then we're gonna search the number 18 in down here is 18 here is 18 with 6 so I'm gonna put 18 down then 6 up, then I'm gonna subtract, 8 minus 8 is 0, 1 minus 1 is 0, then we bring down the next number which is 6, I'm gonna search for 6 in down, here is 6, so I'm gonna put 6 down, and 2 up, by subtraction we get 0, there is no other numbers to bring down. We want to divide. 847 divided by 7 first as we know I'm gonna put up and down here is 1 2 3 4 5 7 by 1 is 7 
7 by 2 is 14 7 by 3 is 21 7 by 4 is 28 and 7 by 5 is 35 I'm gonna take the first number which is 8 first I'm gonna divide 8 and instead of division I will search for 8 in down there is no number called 8 in down but the nearest number is 7 so I'm gonna take the number 7 I'm gonna put 7 down and 1 up after division and the multiplication, 1 by 7 is 7, we're going to subtract. 8 minus 7 equal 1. Then we bring down the number 4. 14, searching down, here is 14. So I'm going to write 14 down. And 2 up. Then subtract. 4 minus 4 is 0. 1 minus 1 is 0. Then bring down the next digit, which is 7. Search for 7. Yes, here it is. We're going to put 7 down and 1 up. Then subtract. We have end our example by getting 0. Okay. Now we're going to divide by a two-digit number. So we're going to make the same steps, but here we have a two-digit number. I'm going to put first 348. Uh, sorry 384 and we are dividing by 16 first I'm gonna get a timetable for 16 here is up and down in up we have one two three four five then 16 by 1 is the same number 16 then we're gonna multiply 16 by 2. 2 by 6 is 12. We're gonna put 2 and carry up 1. 2 by 1 is 2 and we have 1 up. So the answer is 3. 16 by 3. I'm gonna remove the old carry. Then multiply 3 by 6 equal 18. We're gonna put 8 and carry up 1. 3 by 1 is 3 and we have 1. So the answer is 4. Next one, 16 by 4, 4 by 6 is 24, we're going to put 4 and carry up 2, 4 by 1 is 4 and we have 2, so the answer will be 6, remove the old carry and multiply by the next one, 5 by 6 is 30, we're going to put 0 and carry up 3, 5 by 1 is 5 and we have 3, so the answer is 8. After getting the timetable 16, because we have a two-digit number, we divide by a two-digit number, we're gonna get a two-digit number from inside. So I mark the number 38 and search for 38 in down. If you didn't find the number 38, search for the nearest number to 38. So the nearest one is either 32 or 48, but 48 is bigger than 38. So I'm going to take the nearest number but smaller than 38, which is 32. So I'm going to mark on 32. I'm going to put 32 down. And it has 2 up. Then I'm going to subtract. 8 minus 2 is 6. And 3 minus 3 is 0. After subtraction, we're going to get down the next number, which is Four. Now we are searching for the number 64 in down. Here is the number 64. We're going to put 64 down. And we have up 4. Then we subtract by getting 4 minus 4 is 0. And 6 minus 6 equals 0. Now we have finished our example and the answer is 24. Example number B. We have 2,430 divided by 18. We're going to do the same steps. First, we're going to make a table for the number 18. Here is up and down. In up, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 18 by 1 is 18. Then 18 by 2. 2 by 8 is 16, we're gonna put 6 and carry up 1. 
2 by 1 is 2 and we have 1 so this is 3 remove the old one and move to 3 3 by 8 is 24 4 and carry up 2 3 by 1 is 3 and we have 2 so the answer is 5 remove the old carry and move to the next one 4 by 8 is 32 we're gonna put 2 and carry up 3 4 by 1 is 4 and we have 3 so this is 7 next one remove 5 by 8 is 40 0 and carry up 4 5 by 1 is 5 and we have 4 so this is 9 because we have two digits outside we're gonna take a two digit from the number inside 24 the nearest number to 24 or a smaller than 24 is 18 so I'm gonna put 18 down and we have one up then subtract 4 minus 8 can't be we're gonna pour 1 so this 2 will become 1 and this is will become 14 14 minus 8 after 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 so we have 6 then 1 minus 1 equals 0 after subtraction we bring down the next digit which is 3 now we're gonna search for the number 63 or a number smaller than 63 the number 63 we didn't find it but the number smaller than 63 is 54 so I'm gonna take 54 down and we have 3 up then subtract 3 minus 4 can't be this will be 5 and this will be 13 13 minus 4 is 9 then 5 minus 5 equal 0 after subtraction we get down the next number which is zero the number 90 search it for down yes here is 90 so we're gonna put 90 down and 5 up then subtract 0 minus 0 is 0 and 9 minus 9 is 0 we have finished so the answer of dividing 2430 by 18 is 135 we're gonna divide 3,618 3,618 by 27 by making the same steps we're gonna make first the timetable of 27 here is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 27 by 1 is 27 then 27 by 2 2 by 7 is 14 4 carry up 1 2 by 2 is 4 and we have 1 so this is 5 3 by 7 is 21 1 and carry up 2 3 by 2 is 6 after 6 7 8 then 4 by 7 is 28 8 and carry up 2 4 by 2 is 8 and we have 2 so this is 10 5 by 7 is 35 we're gonna put 5 carry up 3 5 by 2 is 10 and we have 3 so this is 13 after finishing the table, we're gonna take two digit number because we divide by a two digit number. 36, I didn't find 36, but the nearest number to 36 is 27. I can't take 54 because it's bigger than 36. So I'm gonna put 27 down. Then we have one up. Then subtract. Six minus seven can't be, this will be two and this will be 16 16 minus 7 is 9 and 2 minus 2 is 0 we're gonna bring down the next number which is 1 so the number 91 I didn't find 91 but the nearest number is 81 so I'm gonna put 81 down and we have 3 up then subtract 1 minus 1 is 0 and 9 minus 8 is 1 bring down the next digit which is 8 then start dividing by searching for 108 here is it I'm gonna put 108 down and we have 4 up by subtracting 108 minus 108 we get 3 zeros and the problem is solved